Hi all, it's Barb coming to you from my craft studio. I have a crafty haul unboxing to share with you today. I got my HSN order. It's just the Crafter's Companion Say It With Style set. Um, so I'm going to share it. I'm going to go through it. I haven't looked at it yet, so I'm excited to go through it. I'll be right back. I'm going to open this on camera and flip through the binder while I'm here. This is the Crafter's Companion Say It With Style um, bundle. It was the HSN Today Special on Craft Day. I debated whether to order it. It stayed like a Today Special for a couple days, so I bought it on the last day. So I bought it on March 31st. The packaging is beautiful. I'll say that for it. I'm just going to kind of read off what was in it. It says there's two five and three quarter by eight and three quarter dies, which cut 39 banner and label shapes, eight five and three quarter by eight and three quarter stamps, which has 156 sentiments, one five and three quarters by 5.59 stamp that has 10 sentiments and one five and a three quarters by three inch stamp that has 10 sentiments 50 pastel colored cards one piece project pocket wallet one magnetic die panel two die storage wallets a meter of five pieces of one meter satin ribbon, five pieces of two meter baker's twine, 25 card blanks, 25 envelopes, five stamp panels, and one binder. I'm going to open the box first. Sarah always presents her stuff so beautifully. I mean, this one has the baker's twine and ribbon in it. Springy colors, I guess. I'm just going to lay that off to the side. The metal dies are in the box, which I was kind of surprised at because I thought they'd be in the binders. I know somebody warned me of that. They had ordered it. said, oh, when you get it, don't panic. <laughs> They're in the box. And these are the two metal dies that will cut out the stamped sentiments. This says pastel card on it. I would have loved if they'd given us one more of those beautiful pens, but here's the, it's also in the pastel type colors. I'm trying to see, no, just, just full sheet. Oops. More tissue paper. These are card blanks. It's very sturdy um, cardstock for the card blanks. My little wrap was kind of coming undone, but it's not a biggie. And then the envelopes are in there. So I just. I'm going to leave those out. Because I'm going to put. 
place those into the binder. So I'm going to move that off to the edge. And there's the binder. Like I said, it's the first time I'm opening it too. I, I kind of opened it up, but I didn't open it any further than what you see right now. So I didn't remove any of the things. I still wanted to because it was taking forever for my... Uh, it's nice, the um, little panel that holds the dies has a little zip pocket on it. I did notice they were really, um, I thought that's where it was supposed to go. Maybe not. Maybe it goes, no, it's supposed to go in this one. Why isn't it going all the way in there? Oh, I guess it will seal. It just didn't feel like it was going in there far enough. But it, it will seal. Go ahead and put those in there. They give you a pocket that you can put um, after you cut out your stamped banners and whatever. Any you don't use, you can put in here. Now, I'd probably put those. I'd want different storage than that because I'd want them more separated, but that's me. They give you a nice sheet of magnet because um, if you got the auto ship, auto ships will come with some smaller dies, so you'll need that for that. Then this sheet, it says birthday wishes is what that's on this panel. We've got happy birthday, sweet wishes for a fantastic day. Let's eat cake, have a fantastic birthday, make a wish, hip hip hooray, enjoy your special day, birthday party, wishing you a fabulous day, happy umpteenth birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. They're kind of different fonts. Another happy birthday, happy belated birthday, surprise, birthday wishes, another birthday wishes here. Have a lovely day. Today's all about you. Many happy returns. Hooray, it's your birthday. Birthday celebration. I need to get over here so I can see better for the other side. This one says, you are not getting older. You're increasing in value. Wishing you the happiest of birthdays. Count your blessings, not your candles. Cheers to you on your birthday. Happy birthday. May your day be filled with joy. Happy birthday. You don't look a day over fabulous. Hope your day is filled with extra icing. Birthdays are set for celebrating. Have a great day. May your birthday be a special celebration. Another one just says happy birthday. Happy birthday to you with love on your birthday. Birthday wishes. Happy birthday. Stay young at heart. There is no such thing as too many candles. The next sheet says time to celebrate. It says I love you. Happy anniversary. Celebrate so happy for you you're amazing well done happy retirement i love your beautiful heart sending love happiness starts here congratulations happy wedding day sip sip hooray you're invited happy new home love and hugs undeniably smitten all of me loves all of you it was always you Put on your dancing shoes. Follow your heart. Happy birthday to you. Happy Valentine's Day. Love is in the air. You're engaged. Let's celebrate in style. So proud of you. Heartfelt congratulations to you. You can always... You are always on my mind and in my heart. I had a hard time reading that one sideways. Sorry about that. Time to celebrate, let's party. Completely in love with you, over the moon for you. You're my person, love you always and forever. You are the love of my life, you did it, new baby, love you. I really think this is gonna have sentiments for just about every occasion. This tab says just to say. This one has just to say, with sympathy, just for you. Deepest condolences, bless you. Thankful, happy, blessed, with thanks, sending love and hugs, be thankful always, sorry, especially for you, warm wishes, thinking of you, so very blessed, thank you, I miss you, with love and hugs, today I am thankful, 
Life is tough, but so are you. Thankful for you. Brighter days are coming. Happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much. You are in my thoughts. Whatever life brings, I am here for you. Surrounding you with love. A day to celebrate. Just a note. Thanks. So very thankful. A bouquet of good wishes. Give thanks with a grateful heart. Hope you're feeling better soon. Gratitude is the heart's memory. Thank you for your support. The best things in life aren't things. The best things in life aren't things. I don't think I've read this one. Gratitude is the heart's memory. Thank you. Thank you. Just a little note. The next tab says family ties. Birthday boy. Love more, worry less, let's celebrate, happy anniversary, super dad, fabulous granddaughter, magic, no, making moments, sorry, make, making memories, sorry, cheers, hold on, let me overthink this, you make my day brighter, happy birthday dad, amazing grandson, you're my hero, too glam to give a damn. Super mom, birthday girl, happy Mother's Day, you're like a sister to me, age only matters if you're cheese, happy Father's Day, you make me smile from our family to yours, family is everything, throw sass around like confetti, my brain has too many tabs open, you say crazy, like it's a bad thing. Family, where life begins and love never ends. Hooray. Everyone was thinking it. I just said it. I like that. Family is where the heart is. Remind me how old you're pretending to be. Laughter puts the wrinkles in the right places. A balanced diet is a cupcake in each hand. Family is not Family is a gift that lasts forever. Happiness is homemade. Don't you think if I was wrong, I'd know it? <laughs> I like that. So proud of you. I have it all. I just need to remember where I put it. I think I read this one already. Family is a gift that lasts forever and well done. The last one says, tis the season. They're not quite as big. Celebrate the season, joy to the world. Holly, jolly, I can't read the other word. I think it says everything. Holly, jolly, everything. Silent night, Merry Christmas, Star of Wonder, New Year, from our home to yours, making spirits bright, jingle bells, deck the halls, merry and bright, winter wishes, peace on earth, ho, 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 jingle all the way, Noel, season's greetings, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. I wish the, the Christmas ones had been full sheets as well. They might have an, uh, one of the auto ships might be Christmas as well, but hopefully it got all of that first box so I don't have to refilm it. And on these dies, you'll, you've probably noticed um, the little X's. If you didn't see, watch the HSM when they did the um, today's special, those are to help you line up the die. I was going to check to see if this would work with my Misty. Because what you do is you, you stamp the whole panel at one time. Each side is one big stamp. I'm just going to see if this would fit in here. Oh, you know, the measurement they gave, I thought it wasn't going to fit but I think it's going to. It will just fit, but it does fit in there. So I'm going to give it a try and see what happens. I'm going to grab some of my own paper though. I don't want to, I don't want to use their paper on my test run. <laughs> Is that bad? I'm like, I don't want to use my paper on the test run. Um, Whoa. Those misty magnets are strong. 
I'll just let this slide them over here. I'm hoping maybe it won't get in the way here because I really don't want to place it there because it'll get in the way. Hopefully there will be enough to hold it, but not enough to get in the way of. I know they say you're supposed to prime your stamps. And I don't usually do that, and I have never really had that big of an issue. I think with this set, a Misty or some sort of stamping tool is going to be very important because you're doing that whole yeah, I can't do that there. I guess I'll just have to make sure it's in the corner because you're doing that whole sheet at once. The sheet may have been just a little too small, but I'm going to go ahead and just try it. A few of them need just a little bit. I didn't get quite... It's good enough. I had a feeling that was going to happen just because it's always really hard to see how much ink is on your stamps. I'm just going to get up and do this real quick. Yeah, I think that's better. Some of them aren't perfect, but it's good enough to see what we need. And I think this one is this panel. I'm not positive. Let's find out. block camera view or anything. There we go. I have some of the Crafters Companion um, low-tack tape, I think they call it. It's I'm going to put a couple of sheets on there. I know she only used one, but I'm not as talented as her, so I'm going to bake it with my Gemini plates. I'm hoping the small Gemini will work. Mm -hmm. Cheat sheet, basic die cutting sandwich. You'd think I'd remember this by now, but I have a couple different machines, and I think maybe that's why. And more often than not, I grab the Gemini, which you can tell by looking at it, because I need to get an extra set of um, dies. Let's see, top clear plate, plastic shim. I'm not going to use the magnetic shim. Die blade up. Yeah, so you can see I got mine a little too close to the edge there, but I'm going to let it go. I'll get enough of them out of here to use them. And then this one. I have my Gemini sitting on the total technique, rotating the design board. It didn't have a lot of clearance on the back, so the rotating design board's nice for that. And it did not work. Oh well, it's good to see mistakes on the thing. Maybe I do need that magnetic sheet now. Maybe I followed my sandwich wrong. Put the mag I'm gonna put the die thing there. It could be I'm just so bowed. But let's try it again. Either that or I really messed up and I put my eye upside down, but I don't think so. 
Yeah, that time we got it. A couple of them aren't going to look quite right because, like I said, my, um, like this one here, my die, my stamping was too close to the edge of my paper. But you see that kind of creates like a little... I probably could have did a better job of stamping, but I'm just using this as an example, so it's fine. I should try priming it and then doing it. But it's kind of cool that you can get all those, and that's why you notice some on the, some of those stamps that had little swirlies in there in different spots, and you thought, well, that looks kind of silly, because I did. <laughs> but when once you cut it out, you can see where that kind of gives that piece some dimension. There's probably a few in here that just won't work because, like I said, they were too close to the edge. It's mainly the ones on this side. That's something I really need to do the next time I order through Crackers Companion or yeah, um. I don't know if scrap, scrapbook.com carries those for a good price or not, or Amazon. Because I don't like to order from um, Crafters Companion unless I have enough for free shipping, and I probably could use some extra plates before I'll order again. But that's kind of a look at the Say It With Style. I think I'll end up using this set a lot. I use my, um, the one they did last year, the companion verse I think they called it um which was more for the inside of the card whereas this is more for the outside of the card it's what's kind of made me think that I'm going to redo my stamps that I have for that have card sentiments into binders and just label them like Christmas birthday so that I can just bring that whole binder over and look and find what I'm looking for I, I kind of find I like to just flip through my stamps when I'm when I'm doing it. So we'll we'll see. Uh, I probably won't do that till to a week of the challenge. But I'm just gonna flip this a little bit. That went longer than I intended, but I may have some editing to do because I know I flipped to the binder part of it twice, but my um camera gave me a low on power message and I didn't realize it and so I'm not sure how much I missed. <laughs> so I'll just have to do some editing and do that but I hope you enjoyed that look at the Say It With Style. How, how many of you out there watched a HSN Craft Day and if you watched did you buy this? <laughs> I even went for the auto ship with it which I was surprised was still there a couple days later but like I said they left it basically listed as a today's special until the end of the end of March which that's craft craft month was March so I suppose that's why they did it um, but so I went ahead and bit I figured I can always go in and cancel the auto ship if I need to but I'm hoping I can just keep it I do think this time the stationery is more practical and that I will use it. I love this box and I don't usually like to keep things in boxes like this, but maybe I will keep it for the elements of this. But I might try to figure out a different way to store it than in the little envelopes, even though the envelopes are, you know, super cute. Maybe I could use those for something else because if you just if you could get the label removed, which does come off pretty easy, you could use that little purple envelope for something else. Because I'd rather be able to look in and see everything that's in there than have have it inside envelopes. I will say, um, 
Crafter's Companion does lovely presentations of things. And it, it's a very nice box. It's so, it has a magnetic closure. You can probably hear it snap there. <laughs> so, if you haven't gotten this, and I think they still might have the bundle. It's probably more now because I'm sure the today's special price ended. But I don't think I'm going to regret buying that. So it, I really struggled with buying it because I just, it was just spending the money that I have a hard time when things cost that much for one item. Finally, just saying, that's it. I'm doing it. I was the same way when I bought my Cricut, same way when I bought my Gemini. Well, not the um, Junior, because the Junior I found on clearance at um, Hobby Lobby, but the bigger, once they get over $100, I honestly probably even over $50, I struggle a little with spending the money. But anyways, that's my look at it. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for joining me. I'll catch you next time.